Hi everybody, welcome back. It's Tuesday night and I thought I'd do a quick little update video. And the first thing I wanna do is I wanna thank Skip from skip o -Matics Model Mania for the great shop card. Thank you very much, Skip. Um, thank you for the kind words on the back. And when I finally get shop card, um, I will send you send you one. And that also goes for everybody else who has sent me one. As soon as I can uh, get some, I will send them out. But if you're not subscribed to Skip, uh, please go do so. He has got a great channel. Does wonderful, wonderful builds. Everybody should be subscribed to him. Check him out. Watch what he's doing. Um, so um, you can catch him on YouTube. And uh, he's got a great card here. I love this. This is perfect. So thank you again, Skip. Appreciate it. Next thing I want to show you is a little update on the pirate Jean Fantine. So I've gotten the skin done. And that is a combination of acrylics and oils. And here's his other, oops, there we go. Here's his other hand. I still have to do the um, fingernails on both of his hands. But uh, skin is pretty much done, I think. I might go back and just touch it up a little bit, but for the most part, it's pretty much done. I still obviously have to do his eyes. So there's that. I think this is starting to, I think this turned out pretty well. Let me know what you think about that. And then uh, also uh, my next car build is going to be the Ravel Foos Custom Cadillac Eldorado. Um, I'm sure most of you are acquainted with this particular uh, design uh, builds, uh, the trucks and all the other cars and stuff like that, but um, I wanted to do a Cadillac. Um, I am, I have some ideas for the body and how I want the body paint to look like for this. Um, I have a little bit of practicing to do first before I actually start painting the body because I'm, I want to see if it works first before I put it on here and screw this up. So, um. I might try to do, um, I actually, what I ended up doing is I, I went on eBay and I found somebody who was selling, um, just bodies, you know, plastic bodies from kits that he person wasn't building or, you know, what, I don't know what, you know, why, but whatever he had like four or five of them. And I picked them up for like $18 off of eBay. I'm just waiting for them to show up now. But I'm going to practice the technique that I want to use on one of those before I try it on this. Because I want to see if I can get it the way I want uh, without screwing the actual car up. And that way when I go to this, I can just do it and hopefully it turns out the way I'm expecting. Um, so there's that. Uh, I'm looking forward to this build. I've already opened it up and just kind of looked at it. Uh, there's lots of great parts in here. Um, I think this is going to be a fun build. Uh, and uh, as I get closer to doing the practice run on the extra car bodies that I picked up, I will, uh, I'll let you see, you guys see a little bit about what I'm doing without revealing too much because I kind of want to keep it a surprise for this. Um, I do have a question. So hold on. I'll be right back. So I know everybody has got spares of models and, you know, your spares box and all that kind of stuff. Now, obviously I haven't, building, haven't been building car models for very long. So obviously what I have is very limited and very small. I know most of you guys probably have way more extensive collection of spares, but I was wondering 
how do you keep them? Like, how do you, you know, uh, do you have something specific? Do you just throw it all in a box like I've done with this? Um, you know, do you label them? Do you, you know, you just say, you know, like engine parts or, you know, do you try to group them by, you know, like V8s or V6s or, you know, whatever, tires, wheels, hubcaps, you know, whatever, you know, whatever you're doing or however you do it. How do you organize your spares? I'm looking for uh, some suggestions on that because I'm kind of curious as to how uh, you guys take care of your stuff, especially, you know, those of you who've been building for a long time, I'm sure you've got lots of this. Uh, so I was just kind of curious as to, you know, how you guys do your spares, whether you put something in the comments or if you, you know, make a video or something. So, uh, you know, I can see it and maybe others, maybe others out there, you know, might like to see what you guys are doing with your spares. Um, I would appreciate it because uh, I try to stay somewhat organized with my stuff. I, I laugh a little bit because that doesn't always happen, but I do try to stay somewhat organized. So, um, like I said, real quick video. Um, so again, go subscribe to Skip if you have not. Okay. Great guy. Great channel. Watch him. Uh, you saw the update on the pirate. Let me know what you think on uh, the skin tones for this guy. I think this is I think this is turning out pretty well. And then uh, the Foos Cadillac, and then your spares box. What do you guys do with your spares? Let me know. Hope everybody's having a great week. It's Tuesday. I'm actually off tonight. Kind of, sort of. I'm at home, but I'm kind of on call, but not really. I don't know. It's a weird thing. Don't worry about it. Anyway, I hope everybody's doing well. Thank you to all subscribers. And uh, thank you to everybody so far who has responded to the 400 subs uh, video that I put up. Uh, the drawing, again, will be uh, Thursday night about 7 p.m. Uh, Pacific Standard Time, which is what I think I put in the video the first time. Um so I will be doing that then, and I'll post it after that. So stay tuned for Thursday's video. And um, again, I hope everybody's doing really, really well and having a great week. I will talk to you all real soon. Bye.